Here's something really interesting that I'm noticing in the conversations that I'm having with people. Now, I am privileged and inspired to be able to have these conversations and really just ask people what they do, why they do it, and soak up their purpose, their big why, you know, why they're in this. This is the thing that they're here to do in life no matter what, no matter what they are doing. So I get to ask them about that and I get to hear it and then I get to reflect it to them and I, I show them what I see and what I feel about what they're doing what they're really doing, the impact they're making on their lives. Um, I'll give a quick example. Another mentor of mine, amazing, amazing woman, was telling me about where her business is headed and I see her integrating all kinds of really interesting things into her business on her website, in her conversations, in the work that she's doing. She is an intuitive coach who combines so many different things. She's, she's always looking for, um, hopefully it, I can remember how to reflect what I got from her, but she uses her own life and herself as a testing ground in an experiment to determine what helps us create what we really want, take an idea and manifest it in life and really experience what it is to be human. I think I said it better after I'd really spoken to her. Um, but it was something that I really understood and I really got. And she just, wow, you got it. You got me. You understood me, right? That was the response she, she gave me. Um, but she also said, you know, I can talk to you about this stuff because you understand it. You get it. And a lot of people don't. And that same thing has been coming up, that theme and other people I've been talking to. You know, I can say this to you because you get it. You understand this purpose I have. You understand my mission and what I'm really trying to do. But most people don't and they don't want to hear it and I don't know how to communicate it clearly. And I started thinking because I've been doing the same thing. These are the best parts of what these already amazing entrepreneurs, experts, teachers, and healers have to offer. The very best part. It's wrapped up in that purpose, the big mission, what they're really doing, right? And they're hiding it. They're not telling people fully everything that they're doing. And it occurs to me that so many times we're hiding the best parts of ourselves and our business. I find this all the time, even when I'm doing more conventional business coaching or consulting and I look at the business and there's this tiny little thing over here that's sort of buried on the about page or on some obscure blog post and I'm like what is that that is real that is compelling bring it out show us and we're hiding the very biggest gifts we have because either it doesn't fit what everybody else is doing or we're afraid of what people are going to think or we're going to they're not going to understand it or we haven't figured out how to communicate it so we hide it the best stuff the goodies is hidden and i've been doing it too that's what the awakened business this website these conversations are all about for me it's bringing it out it's forcing me to bring it to the surface because it's not comfortable for me so many for so many years I've been just delivering strategy teaching people the strategy for getting more business more clients and raising their price and communicating their value and I love strategy don't get me wrong I will never give it up but I've been hiding this purpose I've been hiding this what I'm really doing which is I am showing powerful entrepreneurs their true identity and their power I am helping them connect that to their business to make a bigger impact and I've been hiding that because it's for me it's a very spiritual thing I'd call it even sacred I would use the word sacred for it and I've been hiding that and obviously I'm not hiding that anymore because I just told you I want to encourage you today to think about what's the thing you really want to say, like inside you. It wants to be said. It might even feel like it's from outside of you, right? What is that thing that really wants to be said, that thing you, that really wants to be created but you're afraid to do it? How could you do that just a little bit today, just a tiny bit? Please do it because this is what we're waiting for. This is what you're here to bring. And I can't wait to be a part of that. 